funeral of a friend. He referred to the dates on her tombstone from the beginning to the end. He noted that first came her date of birth and spoke the following date with tears, but he said what mattered most of all was the dash between the years, in this case, 1900-1970. For that dash represents all the time that this person spent alive on earth, and now only those who love her know what that little line is worth. For it matters not how much we own, the cars, the house, the cash. What matters is how we live and love and how we spend our dash. So think about this long and hard. And there are things you'd like to change, but you'll never know how much time is left that still can be rearranged. If we could just slow down enough to consider what's true and real and always try to understand the way other people feel and be less quick to anger and show appreciation more and love the people in our lives like we've never loved before. If we treat each other with respect and more and more than often wear a smile, remembering that this special dash might only last a while. So when your eulogy is being read with your life's actions to rehash, would you be proud of the things they say about how you spent your dash? Okay, I found that quite good. You know, I, I, uh, I, when I read that, it was just, it is so true with what you do with that time, and you never know how much time you have. None of us do. I would share with you some fun things, too, from Robert Fulgham, who wrote a book called What I 